thing I like about the YouTube comments is when somebody sees you doing something and they comment, they got a better way of doing it. So right now, I caught a screen in the front and the back and he said, you don't need to code a screen on the front. All you need is to code it on the back. So that's what we're gonna do when we get to the shop. So let's do this. I got a three color left chest print to do today on a couple of different color shirts and I have to do some ink changes. So anyone asking you for to do some ink changes, I charge them $10 per ink change. You gotta charge them something or they'll take advantage of you, okay? And the other thing is I wanna thank um, Mr. Gordon from Let Me Fall for bringing me the LKTF 1000 shirt folder. I haven't opened it yet, but I just want to say it's good looking for bringing me that gift. I'm going to check it out, and I know I'm going to like it because I've seen it already on his video. Go to his Instagram, um, Let Me Fall, and check him out, man. But right now, I want to talk about how to register multiple colors simple and quick. If you follow this process, you ain't going to have no issues doing it, man. So right now, let's get started. All right, I just finished registering the three color image that we have to do and every time that you do that right when you are putting your film like right here you see film is right on the palette you register everything there once you do that do not remove the film out of that palette just move move and move on to the next palette leave that there just in case i have to register something i'm not getting it just to go back because once you move that film then everything changes so make sure you do that once you have that there now is when you're going to bring your palette in. you're going to bring your um, clear registration tape and you're gonna register and that's what I'm gonna do right now so you can see how quick you could register any any amount of colors very fast let's do this very dry your stars heating up we're gonna go open that box that we just received this morning Okay, I got Mr. Gordon had emailed me a few weeks ago and asked me for my address. He wanted to send me a gift and this is it. And this is a t-shirt folder. This automatic t-shirt folding machine is simple to use and with two minutes of training, you should be a professional t-shirt folder. This unit is designed to fold t-shirts ranging from adult, small to 3X. Not bad. Place the t-shirt facing down on the collar to your half an inch from the top of the edge machine. If the bottom edge of the t-shirt hangs, just like the regular folding, um, fold it upward, over, and in itself, stand back and push either button on the each side and it should do something like this. <laughs> let's see that again. All right, let's bring a shirt. T-shirt, he said, an inch from there, from the collar, right? Put it just like that. If it goes over, just flip and then push any button. Let's see. Ho oh, oh. ho! Not bad. Not bad. Hey, Heron Gordon, thank you so much. I'm gonna be using this. I'm gonna have the description down below if you guys are interested in ordering it. Something that he's been working on for a while. I checked him out on his Instagram. His Instagram is, I'll have it down there. It's called Let Me Fall. You know, so go check him out, man. 
So I'm gonna place this automatic t-shirt folder right here. And oh, by the way, check that out. Look at this. Took the wall out and another wall inside and now looks more open. Plus, you'll be able to now see right through here. This wall, I took it out. Now from exposing straight to the wash booth and check that out. Look, this space here, I was able to fit the screen rack right there. Real nice. So now from here that I'm coating the screen, put it right in here, take it out, take it to expose and then wash booth. Awesome. Dip tank right there and come out through here and ha, huh, awesome man. So now with this t-shirt further, I'm going to add it into my price quote and I'm going to have to now put it in, in my uh, management software, which is today's sponsor of this video is called Printable. I obviously want to thank our sponsor for today's video, which is Printable. If you're having issues with managing orders or deadlines, then I highly recommend Printable. Printable is a simple management software. Printable will help you manage orders, handle scheduling, automation, and online stores. Regardless if you're a small or big print shop, Printable will help you streamline your business. Right now, if you go to printable.com and use the promo code TAINO, you're gonna get 50% off the first month. And the good thing is that once you go into printable.com, there are three packages that you could um, choose, which is best for you. Your small print shop, you know what you're gonna use, your big print shop, there's a package for you. So I wanna thank Printable for sponsoring today's video. Back in my bag, yo. Conscious. Iso. Down. Back in my bag and I ain't gotta brag, I do this shit for real. When we was down and we had nothing, we had to share a meal. We put the shit in overdrive with no steering wheel. Shorty throw that thing back in a pair of hills. Yeah, and she be riding on that thing like a Ferris wheel. Yeah, I love them dark skin, brown skin, caramel. You know I had to bring it to the hood like she carrying. Oh, oh man, let me tell you, man. Not all the time I register three colors and get it on the first time. Everything is at is perfect, ready to print. But if you have to do any adjustments, that's why I suggest to use the clear registration template where then I could just wipe off this black and then register again. And then all you gotta do is come back to your film over here and make sure you align everything perfectly and then go and test run but keep that film on one pallet, do the clear registration tape, and your registration will be much, much better. Now, let me just do this order right here real quick, and then we're gonna go test that screen that I'm gonna coat only using one side, and let's see how it exposed. But before I get started, it's lunch time. Tizzle when she keep on turning head Cause when she woke that thing jiggle, jiggle And we going back to back on them Like we Huey and we Riley This that back in my back flow We back again so highly This that back in my back flow We back to change the climate This that back in my back flow We bring the force like Tommy Back in my Back in my back flow Back in my Yeah, yeah Back in my bag, yeah I'm back in my Yeah, yeah I'm back in my bag, yeah Getting a pepperoni slice From one of the best Pizza shops in the Bronx, man, right here in Bethel Park. Check it out. All right. Done eating the pizza. Now let's get printing. Off that dope, like I'm back again to visit at the Millie's. I don't club hers. Give the word if it's a city, love for me. Still have emotion, dog. So why would I slow it? Make it rain on them, bust a the band, then you throw it. We were steady having it, even at our lowest. High speed roll, run and keep my motor going. Hey, hey, people feel away, but they don't show it. Gotta watch the people that surround you as you grow it. They be coming around you with some plans to steal your moment. Soon as I bust a nut, she be like, baby, where you going? Never slowing down. It's enough to go around. Yeah, you probably knew it's then, but really, you don't know it's now. Niggas let it show. So here's the screen we coded only on the back side, but so far looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. Let's expose it. We back to change the climate. This that back in my back flow. We bring the force like Tommy. Back in my back in my back flow. Back in my yeah yeah. Back in my bag yeah. I'm back in my yeah yeah. I'm back in my bag yeah. I'm back in my. All right, here it is, nice and dry. Looks pretty good. It came out 
Nice, huh? Some little areas here, got a, it feel, looks a little light, but I think if I'm gonna only coat it three times, I should have coat it two times, turn it around, and then two more times without coating the front. And I, the same amount of emotion, I guess, I could do that, but you don't even feel the stencil, which that's also a good thing. It's not gonna put a lot of deposit on the ink, so it's gonna make it look thinner and smoother, I guess, but yeah, I think that's what I'll, I'll keep experimenting and see that maybe I'll use the round side of the scoop coater and apply it very slowly twice. You know, I did, I used the sharp side of the scoop coater, but maybe using the round side of the scoop coater only on this side here, it'll, it'll come out like if I did both. All right then, so if you like this video, press that like button. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. Be thankful always, be grateful always, and just let God take you on the right. Peace out.